Welcome to my Guardians video. Very small percentage of blah 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 blah, that's nice. Uh. Oh good, he uses autosave. I I do think it's interesting that you can only play as Star Lord though. But I'm not judging too much. If it wasn't to me personally, I'd probably just be lazy and just play as Groot the whole time if I could choose. Dude, this is a pretty house. <clears throat> kind of reminds me of the Kent farm from the DC universe. Of course, his room would be down there. <laughs> Ooh, it's his mom. Hey, birthday boy. No wonder you can hear me. <clears throat> you tape? Star Lord. Who's the guy with the scary eyes? He doesn't have a name. He's one of the space riders. And he's not scary. He's cool. Your space rider certainly got his hands full. Pretty far out! Nobody says far out anymore, Ma. <laughs> Ma! What? Nobody says far out anymore. Oh, well, your mom and dad. Maybe <laughs> I should see if we could get tickets to see them live. Really? Mm hmm. Your mom may not look it, but I was quite the rocker when I was your age. It's not a toy, it's an action figure. More like an action landmine. Stab your foot. I will. <laughs> he doesn't even. Never mind. Thirteen whole years. <laughs> That's chewy. Where does time go? I'll be up in a sec, I promise. Right. Bro, he does not sound thirteen. He sounds older because of how deep his voice is. <clears throat> yeah, get out of bed. Yeah, I see you got that, uh, what was it, that, you got that Frog Brothers look from Lost Boys. <laughs> I almost forgot their last name from that movie. Whoa. Was it a dream? Oh my god, it's <laughs> Strax. Crap, Drax. <clears throat> you gotta stop doing this, man. It's weird. We are approaching the quarantine zone. How long Christ. was I out for? 15,338 ticks. That's very specific. The betrayer is ready to begin our mission. She has requested <laughs> presence in the cockpit. Mora's on our side, Drax. She is the spawn of my sworn enemy, a murderess and a traitor. I do not trust her. We'll try. We're supposed to be a team. I make no promises. <laughs> Again, I ain't gonna lie, that jacket's kinda cool. Ooh, I even like the guns. It ain't just the junkyard. The quarantine zone's the biggest pile of galactic war debris in the known universe. Ah, oh, there you are, Quill. Tell Groot to stop worrying about getting arrested. I am Groot. I'm <laughs> not overconfident. I'm just the right level of confident. <laughs> arrested? For what? 
Our okay, ship that's how you do it. Accidentally slipped into the quarantine zone. Oops, our navigation malfunctioned. Oops. How would we accidentally cross into the Novacore force field? Details. <laughs> we must soon discuss the status of my official team membership badge. Drax, once again, there is no official badge. <laughs> Drax. Belcamora. <laughs> and this not wait, Peter Quill. I am readying my body for battle. Uh, <laughs> you know we're supposed to capture this monster, right? Not kill it. Of course. But I suspect it will not go down without a fight. Cool it, muscles. Lady Hellbender ain't gonna buy damaged goods. I will aim to preserve the integrity of the beast as best I can. Good. Hey, uh, Groot. What is it? Dude, take five. We gotta talk about that Gamora thing. She is waiting for you in the cockpit. I know, I know, I just meant... Are you gonna be okay? You two are gonna be alone on the ship for a while. Rest assured, Peter Quill. I will keep a watchful eye and thwart any attempt at treachery. Or... You could try trusting her. <laughs> you are naive, Peter Quill. She is a mistress <laughs> of deceit. <laughs> All good, buddy? I'm Groot. You know, I don't understand you, Groot, but I'm gonna assume you just said something super kind and thoughtful. <laughs> no, he didn't. What did the tree say? No idea. <laughs> really needs to get these plants under control. So, Drax, excited to meet our buyer after we catch the monster? Of course. Lady Hellbender is a legendary warrior and a noble queen. And she's rich. That is not a prowess, simply a commercial fact. As long as she buys her monster, she doesn't need to be royalty. You are jealous of her status. Good old Milano. Engine parts from at least five different black markets. Yes. That's my chair. Oh. <laughs> then why aren't you in it? I was, uh, strategizing. It's just one thing to get into the zone, but we still gotta catch that monster. Right. So did I miss anything? Other than a ton of suspicious glares from Drax, not really. Now, if you're done strategizing, feel free to grab your seat. We're almost ready to go. Yay! Trophy for doing that. Rocket Groot Drax, get in here. We're going in. We still have a few ticks before the next time window, actually. The next one? Nova Corps security guard resets every rotation. We want to be in and out before our code expires, or we'll get stranded. And if we wait for the next reset, we'll get a full rotation to do this. Nice. <laughs> oh, why is the Nova Knight <laughs> still up? Thought we were going in. Appears the assassin's contacts are as untrustworthy as the betrayer herself. Oh, please don't tell me Gamora's backdoor codes are bust. We nearly went broke getting them. Relax, Rocket. We still got a few ticks before the next time window. The network just reset. You can enter the sequence, Peter. 0451. That's it? Four digits? Suspicious. These security measures are too simplistic for Novacore. It's not that simple. The code only works on this date for this ship. Oh, I get it. Gamora's codes are more like an encryption key of some sort, designed to integrate temporal coordinates and our ship's hard-coded serial into a local number generator. Info gets in, digits come out. There. There you go. Kind of cool. And we're in. Incredible. I never realized there was so much stuff left after the war. Restraint wasn't very popular in the Shatari army, especially with Thanos in charge. Yeah, it's probably all harmless now. 
I mean, Novacore had 12 years to get rid of the heavy-duty explosives, right? <laughs> That's why I like you, Quill. You're so pure. Oh, the wonderful and terrible things I could do with all this tech. Stay focused, Rodent. We do not come here to scavenge. Why not? The Milano's weapon systems could use an overall. Plus, there's good money in it. At least that we seek is far I mean, more valuable to the monster queen of Seknoff Nine. I do see Rocket's point. Whoa! Oh, the place is really shifty. I'm not seeing a monster, but that big cylinder up ahead looks like the mining ship Peter's friend said to look for. <clears throat> friend. For a night? And you'll see the monster as soon as we place Rocket's monster summoning thingies. Flark, yeah. Brute, Quill, <laughs> Soda. Team Rocket's up first. I still do not understand why I must remain on board with the assassin. Oh, because you're part of Green Team. You assigned me to the team before you named it. My skin is not green. It is teal. Teal? What? What the heck is teal? <laughs> Listen, if we want to trick the monster into going inside that mining rig, we need to place thumpers on both sides. Two sides, two teams. And two clicks at the drop side. Ground's too unstable to land the ship, so you'll need to jump. That's our cue. Let's go, Groot. <laughs> Don't Did worry! Once the thumpers are placed, we'll meet in the middle and we'll capture the monster. Together. Very well. <laughs> Thumper one, done. Meet you at the rendezvous point. Yay! Mora, take care of my baby. It's a ship, Peter, not a child. Oh, oh. can you imagine? What, the pink goo? It's custom nano resin, designed to keep all this war stuff from floating away. Pretty lovely. I'm thinking that big cylinder thing is our rendezvous? Yeah, that's the mining rig. So weird seeing it all clustered together like this. Bits and pieces of a war that spanned the entire galaxy held together by... pink goo. Ebrium based nano resin. You know, I think I do sort of get it. Thousands of worlds fighting for some fleeting greater good. Guess it is kind of poetic. I am good. Ah, cheer up. Just because the war was horrible doesn't mean there wasn't good times along the way. I am good. Yeah, I am mostly talking about stuff blowing up. I think I figured that out beforehand. After we sell the monster, I say we head to nowhere. Do some gambling. Whoa! I'm okay. Ha! <laughs> Almost made yourself a very late war casualty. Not funny. There we go. It is strange. I have not encountered any corpses in the wreckage. You know, I like this. This is fun. The three of us hanging out, just like when we started this gig. Before you know who joined us. I, am Quill. I do not hate everybody. I tolerate Quill. Quill's a, a swell guy. I hope you get that promotion, Rocket. Are you calling me a bootlicker? <laughs> the three of us have had some good times. Careful on that thing, Quill. You spot something out there? Don't worry. It's safe to walk nope, around, I have not. mostly. That's why green team's on the Milano. Heck of a lot more dangerous to fly around in here. I heard that. Whoa! Pretty Whoa, sure that yeah. that end. <laughs> uh, you sure? Ah, there we go. Path's this way. Come on. How can you even tell? Just trust me, all right? Hey, group. you think we could find pieces of the Trion shard in here? 
How'd you even know the other way was a dead end? Because, unlike you, I have a very keen sense of direction. Whoa. Watch your step, guys. This junk isn't as stable as we think. Uh, that is one big mushroom. Fire. Uh, fungus, bacteria, mold, space gunk. You know, call it what you want. It's still in the way. Brittle stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Ugh. I hate these ship eating parasites. Larkas would shoot right through the Milano in two cycles. Looks like they've gotten no <laughs> Gross. <laughs> nice splatter. Hey, 50 units says I can clear more of these suckers than you. As if. Whoa, what the? Rocket, did you do that? The scoreboard? You like it? Hacked it into your visor cover last time you took a snooze. You hacked into my stuff? Considering how many times I fixed the Flarkin thing, it might as well be my stuff. Optimal thumper placing distance should be just up ahead. I'm thinking right in front, through the giant hole where this ship's cockpit used to be. Well, that's grim. Uh, yeah, try not to think about it. It's better not to wonder what happened to anyone working on these old wrecks. It was a long time ago, anyways. Ah! Ah! Oh! Amazing! I should have been recording. Bridge, yeah. I want to see if he's alive. I, I don't know, but he's twitching. Flarkin, Scott Stain, Quill. You okay down there? Yep. Yeah, just, uh... I thought I saw a shortcut. shortcut. Right. Go ahead without me. I'll catch up. Okay. There's a craft out Novacore missile bay just on the other side. We'll meet you there. Yellow and blue missile bay. Got it. Shot a thing. I get it. First tool in the old toolbox. Uh. Ooh, don't die, don't die, don't die. Peter. Oh, hey, little guy. Oh, God. <laughs> I should have seen that. It was this weird blobby thing. <laughs> Not falling for this again. Fight with dignity, <laughs> Peter Quill. Or at least die with it. Not funny. It is good to be doing physical labor again. Kinda hard to believe you were a farmer. I was a warrior. Working the soil can be as satisfying as battle. I am Groot. I really doubt pulling weeds is as good as pulling heists. 
Eh, it's kind of okay. Especially when you get paid to do it. I used to pull weeds for people. After we catch this monster, we really should spend half a cycle loading up the Milano with tech. Uh, Quill, we got a lot riding on your gal pal's mystery monster tip. I hope she's legit. Like you could even tell if she had an honest face. Yeah, well, she did smell like flowers. Trust in the plan, guys. Everything is checked out so far, right down to the mining ship. We put our thumpers in the right places, and we'll bag that monster. Uh, Quill knows all about putting thumpers in the right. Mother of Scott! Move! <laughs> Uh, are you kidding me? Son of a smash. That was too close. You okay, Groot? Well, we're fine, but we can't jump that. You don't gotta jump. There's a sturdy support beam on this side. Get Groot to grow a bridge across. Just ask him nice like. He does it for me all the time. Okay. All right, Groot. Let's see that cool viney thing. Oh, no. That's one hell of a party trick, big guy. Gross. More ship eaters. All right. Boom. Right under your nose, Quill. Dang it. I don't really want to challenge him, but whatever. Of course there ain't any plants here. It's a junkyard. Plants grow where they got food. We gotta go that way, across the gap. Somehow. Do I look worried? The resin will hold. Yeah, it's close enough for Groot the bridge if you can find a proper handhold. Hey, Greenies, you see any blue and gold ships out there, you will let us know. We have seen many such ships. He means active ones. We haven't talked about what to do if we run into a Nova Corps patrol. Uh, we will restrain them until we are done here. Bad idea. Those cops are all connected through their stupid helmets. If any sign of cops, we surrender, okay? We do not surrender. I'm with Drax on this one. We all have criminal records, and they'll be looking for any excuse to arrest us. I may have a couple aces up. Okay, here we go. All right, set her down right there. Yep, one to go. Flark! No, no! Flark and Skaggy! Attack and battery spry, that's what's wrong. Maybe you put it down too hard. Let's just find a solution. A solution to a new battery. With a charge. Okay. We're on what's left of a ship. Full of ship things. Gotta be things that power ship things around here, right? Yeah. Maybe you're gonna want to use your visor for this. You find a replacement while I finish scraping the fried wires. Yeah. So what do I gotta do to get a last name like Drax's? Katathians have no need for surnames. What about the Destroyer? Got an oxygen pump here! <laughs> hey! A huge power generator! How do we hook it up? We don't! That thing would toast our little thumper. <laughs> condense the power through a routing funnel or something? Don't try to make up tech stuff. It's irritating. Find something else. Peter Quill. The double agent is trying to lull me into a false sense of security. Found a compressor. No charge. Ah, uh, no charge. No good. So, Drax, how come you're so in love with this Hellbender lady? I do not love Lady Hellbender. Yeah, shouldn't you be all like, her name is illogical. You cannot bend hell. That does not at all resemble me. 
<laughs> Found something with a charge. Kind of looks like a spacey car battery. Loose oil or xenon cell. Okay, this thing isn't gonna zap me, right? The chance is minuscule at best. You'll be fine. <laughs> minuscule. Here you go. That'll do nicely. Just let me tinker a bit. I'll have to do some tweaking once I see how much juice this thing puts out. So, uh, watch my back. Watch it from what? Rocket! Help me scramble some critters! No, 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 Scott! If I don't rewire this fast, it's gonna short circuit! Flocking monster things! Everyone get ready! Hold them down, crew! Oh, cool. Just keep these things away from me. <laughs> They're running this way. Oh, it's like pumping a sick. If I don't fix this thing, they'll keep coming. Well, watch it. Yes, I did it. Wow, just in time. I'd like to see you fix it next time. Come on, two down, two to go. Groot's wondering if the reward's gonna be worth all the risk we're taking for this job. Me and Groot are nearly unkillable, but what if the rest of you don't make it out alive? If the two of us gotta lug that monster- Guys, this job is a huge deal. It's for the freaking monster queen of Seknarf 9. She just- doesn't know it yet. We pull this off, and we're Lady Hellbender's intergalactic monster anglers. Man, that thing is ridiculous. Think it was a ship or a robot? That's a pre-century, a robot, but it would have been spaceworthy. <laughs> that ain't even the biggest one. They designed at least five experimental models twice that size. Impressive, but I could fly circles around something that big. Give me a fast and sexy M-Class scout over those things any day. I do appreciate that sweet Ravager pirate tech. She's made for hidden runs. <laughs> and boy, can she run. She can hit too. There's always room for more firepower. <laughs> that sentry probably took on whole fleets. This old creature... God, they never wondering. shut up, do Where they? Where would I be now with those blue butt scots made of in their half-world experiments? Yeah, chances are you'd be climbing over bits of me right now. Groot, need you to shoot a bridge right into that eye socket. Now, I want to see you do that to something in combat. Is that... Yes! I'm about to win this bet, Quill! Here goes nothing! <laughs> We're inside a giant robot head. And I got robot parts inside my head. You have robot parts inside your head. Bam! <laughs> Down the nest! Maybe this is the Parasite Clubhouse! Damn it. Where is everything? How's that bet going over there? I look forward to one of you winning, then perhaps this senseless chatter will cease. Turn off your radio if you're not happy. I take no orders from you. Don't congratulate him! Well, I know what I would do with the money. 
I would save it up for our next stop on Contraxi and get one of those Zeronian massages. Keep dreaming. I can hear your visor working. Better not be cheating on our bet, Quill. How can you hear? Exactly. You suck, Star Chod. I'm Groot. After I beat Quill? Or after I beat you? When I get the upper hand and win by a landslide, I'm getting my hands on some rotating hyper circuits. Boo! No one knows what those are. That one was juicy! What do you think, Drax? Should we get in on this bet? Think of all the hyper circuits you can buy. Are you making fun of me? I do not wish to acquire hyper circuits. Well, I hear you scanning. I'm having the time of my life. I'm good. Quill, shoot down a nest if you're having fun. Speaks for itself. I am good. No, we can't take the giant robot home. And believe me. That's a painful sentence for me to say. <laughs> and just so we're clear, Green Team is officially ineligible for the battle. <laughs> Why? Well, for one, you need a gun. No need for a projectile weapon. Hey, Rocket! Didn't you say you were at least twice as good a shot as me? When did I say that? Uh, some while ago. I, I don't know. You're not delivering on it, man. Just hold on to your stupid jacket. I'll show you. Where am I supposed to go? I can't go up there. There we go. Imagine something this big coming at you. A whole ship was like a bug by comparison. So it swat them out of the air like flies. What are flies? They're these annoying flying insects on Earth. Were I allowed to participate? I think I'd spend my bet earnings on a night at Lateco. That's only if you manage to beat me. Wait, isn't Lateco a fancy pants restaurant out on Vega? <sighs> you know what, Quill? I think it's unfair. You got two guns, I got one. I think my points should count double from now on. That's cheating. All right, <coughs> bumper goes there, Quill. <sighs> okay. It's not gonna piss off every critter around, right? Sorry, Quill. Not taking no chances after the last one. I gotta test it real quick. Not again. Rocket! I only flipped the switch on and off to see if it started! Yeah, tell them that! Gotta love that kill radius! Ew, loose cannon. Good for Rocket. How are there this many of them? Lights out, eyeballs! <laughs> Like that time. Come on. Oh yeah. Dirty. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, come on. What the heck are those things? Slugs? Don't talk at it. Shoot it. Very helpful. Thanks. You're welcome. Now stop distracting me. Look, Quill's all Save your nice words for later, Quill. Too long since I blew something up! Not a chance! I've gotten way more! 
Yes. I knew I was missing all the fun last time. Yes. Oh my God. Yes. That was... Oh, I did it. Splatter rocket. I know, right? What was that worth? Five points? Oh, come on! You can't just give yourself points like that. Sure, I can. Hey, green team. Looks like we're done installing our thumpers. Great job. We'll meet you at the mining ship. All right. Mining That's right there. stupid. You gave yourself five points. Cool. As secure as a broke down Shatari shipwreck's ever gonna be. I am Groot. Come on, Groot. We need to get across here. And Rocket wouldn't put you at risk, right? I am Groot. That's right. I've always got your back, bud. I am Groot. Nah, it just looks unstable like everything else in here. Don't get your twigs in a bundle. Yes, the resin can hold a stupid warship. <laughs> I'm telling you, it's totally safe. See, I'll even prove it. Huh? Look at this. <gasps> Rocket? Oh, fuck. Guys, jump! Oh, 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 ah! A moldy driftwood, you could have died saving me. <laughs> I love you too, you selfless son of a drug. Come on, cool. He says I'll meet us at the mining ship. I don't want to make him wait. That's it? We're not going after him? He says it's fine. We'll meet him later. Team Rocket, is everything okay? Root signal just went dark. His radio must have broke when he fell. What happened to your timber companion? He ain't timber. He's alive. He fell. I, I really don't know if you're being clever or dumb right now. Team Rocket, out. Uh, sounds like Green Team's off our backs. Now we can stop worrying about that uh, dumb accident. Groot's fine anyway. There's nothing to worry about. An accident, Rocket? Come on. What? That's all it was. It's your fault. You hadn't fooled around on that ship. I did it. You don't know nothing. Stop trying to be smart. That sure didn't sound like an apology. Nope. Come on, man. You know, we make a pretty dynamic duo, Rocket. Hey, look. A shortcut we can't use because somebody lost Groot. So useful for you to point it out. Thanks. You're welcome. Man, if that afterburner kicked on right now, we'd be toast. Mining ship's on the other side of that turbine, so we gotta find a way through. Try not to jump on anything this time. Groot's not there to grab you if you... Well, either shut up or help me figure out how these blades open. There's a drone access tunnel over here. Too bad we don't got a drone. 
Can you squeeze in there? Knew it. Yes. Rocket, fix the thing. <laughs> Rocket, clean up the mess. Rocket, crawl into the mystery hole. See anything? Yeah. You're the only one that can fit in there. Team Rocket, we hit a snag. One of our thumper points was covered in resin, so we're gonna fly around and scout another spot. Just make sure the new spot is close because of maps and angles. Great. Another turbine. Yeah, that is how these things are usually built. Pew, pew. Pew, pew. Boop. Someone's been practicing. Come on, let's get out of here. We're back on track. The mining ship ain't too far. Think Groot's already ahead of us? Maybe. Hope he didn't get distracted. Crap, 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 crap! It wasn't me this time, I swear! I don't like this! <laughs> Boy, for me! I'm gripping this thing with muscles I didn't even know I had! Oh, crap! <laughs> Where's... Oh, Larkin, son of a... I told you I saw them. Great timing! <laughs> How did you guys... Good to see you two, but you're gonna want to cross the ship as fast I as you can. I think I have more than him. We're seeing a lot of movement! Yeah, Scott's getting real violent out here! Uh, just try to hold her still for us! That's not gonna be an option soon! This position is untenable. Tracks incoming! Watch out! What? Hang on! Oh, crap, We're seeing I a lot of movement. Yeah, Scott's getting real violent out here. Uh, just try to hold her still for us. That's not going to be an option soon. This position is untenable. Tracks incoming. Watch out. What? Hang on. Whoa. Have you perished, Peter Quill? Too much debris. Dang it! Come on, man! When am I supposed to jump? Right at the edge? I better not be all the way back to the ship. Oh, thank God. Like, must be some kind of residual energy in here. Yeah, oh, jeez. Oh, come on. Clark and tensor joint. Just neat. Uh, wiggle the... Okay, so life support's boots back up. What's it look like out there? Holy mother of space ball. Yeah, eat it, rodent. I beat you. <laughs> yes. Yes, I beat him. Oh, I beat him. It's just... Man. Uh... Well, what the heck are you? that uh it's a swarm of old cleaner bots 
Maybe. Old cleaner bots. I don't know. <laughs> you okay, buddy? <sighs> Sorry about the shooting. Yeah, thought you were that freaky thing we accidentally released. Saw! We saw some cleaner bots. <laughs> accidentally. At a distance. We're totally all right. Rocket, I'm not so sure that swarm thing was inoffensive. I feel kind of bad about releasing it. Will took a pot shot at this massive worm nest. A chunk of something fell off and the big floaty creature came out of it. That's all. Yeah. It's better to come clean. A table. This is a vintage Model T engineering workbench. They don't make them sturdy like that no more. Hey, come on, Quill. Let's see if this beauty still works. Maybe I can fix up your gear. It looks hey, like something Calcastus uses in Fallen Order, but okay. And it's done. Yeah, there's a way through if we can clear out that crud. It would suck to get busted in here, you know, with just one exit. Is that supposed to make me feel better? Come on, Quill, put them pea shooters to good use so we can squeeze in there. Yes, okay, now I get it. Thanks for the upgrade. Perfectly safe, right? I don't trust your definition of safe. Uh, seems a little wobbly. You guys hang back a sec. Oh, crap. Uh, this place is crawling with ugly. Guys, I'm not alone down here. Holy crap! This is the most punchable thing I've ever seen! <laughs> what? Red fried and petrified! Yeah! Man, Rocket, you really missed out. That was amazing. Team Rocket! Finally. We couldn't hear you before. Something about the mining ship's been messing up our comms. Yeah, something really ain't right in here. And Quill fell down another hole. Another hole. Yeah, I upgraded. That's cool. For one. I'm parking the Milano, but Drax is out there searching for you. Maybe you'll find Quill before we do. We're trying to catch up to him. Guys, we really need to get better at the buddy system. She is not my buddy. I will find you, Peter Quill. Describe your surroundings. Uh, old metal, old mining equipment, just old. Noted. There we go. Oh, weird cuby hunks of rock or metal. There we go. <laughs> Looks kind of pretty though. I like the texture. You two have any luck? It is not a question of luck. Peter, make some noise so we can find you. Drax. Rex. Hey, you want to mute your comms if you're going to scream your lungs out? Wait, where? 
Peter Quill, I have located some old equipment, but I do not see you. This whole place is old equipment. That does not narrow my search. Yeah. This is kind of a pickle I'm in.